What's going on? This is EGTV Online, and today we are going to discuss how to remove vocals from a particular MP3 file, whether it's hip-hop, R&B, and specifically for you hip-hop artists who have an MP3 to a hot joint that you want to spit to, but in fact you hear the vocals on it. I'm going to show you how to actually remove the vocals from the MP3, bring it to the studio so that your engineer can actually uh, modify it, edit it, and uh, you can do your thing on your mixtape. Uh, with that said, this is for the engineers as well. Uh, today we're going to be using Audacity, which is a freeware program uh, which you can actually uh, download for free. It's a great program. It's an audio editor and you see it right here. And what we're going to do is we're going to import an mp3 file into uh, Audacity. And uh, what you'll see here is it's going to import the mp3 file. Today's file that we're going to play with is Sean Kingston. It's called Me Love. This is the clean version. But essentially what you want to do is import your mp3 file into the Audacity program. We will be displaying some in our show notes exactly where you can download the Audacity program. Again, it's a freeware program, great program for audio engineers as well as artists uh, who are looking to do exactly this. So, we're about five seconds away from importing the mp3 file. You'll actually see when it's imported, when you have a screen like this, you'll see the title of the mp3 file uh, up in the upper left hand corner and you'll see that two tracks are displayed here. This is just an indication that your file is split into stereo. So the first thing you're going to do is just let, let's play this track actually just so you can hear it. That's the beginning and let's see where Sean Kingston's vocals come in. Right around here. Okay, so you hear there's some vocals there. First thing we're going to do is we're going to click right here uh, just on the stereo 4410 hertz air section. Click the drop down menu here and we're going to choose split stereo track. What that will do is create uh, two additional drop downs as you see here. We're then going to select the lower track right here and you'll notice when I click it this will get a shade darker indicating that this track below is highlighted. And then the very next thing we're going to do is going to choose the effect called Invert. And click Invert. What that'll do is add the Invert plugin and effect to the very half portion of the stereo track. The next thing we're going to do is go back up to the top, hit that drop down, and choose Mono and then choose mono again for the lower portion. Okay, we're gonna jump to about the area where uh, Sean Kingston's hook starts and drops. You're gonna hear the hook, but you'll notice that his vocals are incredibly low. So listen to this. Pretty amazing. So as you just heard, most of the vocals have drowned out and you will hear essentially the instrumental. Uh, I will show you in our next segment how to actually drown out the vocals even further. You do hear them a little, but for the most part, you hear the instrumental. And that's it for this segment of EGTV Online. These are your technical tips from a hip-hop perspective. It is your boy, R.A.S. Big up to everybody who's watching.